Did I know this thing would stick on that tiny hair? I didn't. I move with faith. <laughs> shave my face using the gel cleanser method um i will not do that on camera because i definitely don't want to be distracted but also i think i'm gonna just do my lashes also off camera and then switch it back on for doing my base so i will see you in a moment Hey friends, I did my brows and started with my base when I remembered that I'm actually shooting a get ready with me. So I am just on the first base of my foundation. Uh, yeah. I did my eyes off camera deliberately because when I did the tint yesterday, I think, one, I expected it to be darker. Um, but it wasn't as dark as I initially anticipated. So, I went in with my pencil to make the brows darker. I think it's drizzling. This is actually finished. It's definitely the rain. This this foundation is actually lighter than the one I based with. I don't know how that's gonna work. Also, my tiny bits of my tiny bits of lashes keep falling out, so I'm just going to leave them. I was listening to Jacob Banks' music earlier on in the morning. And you know what? I think every single person in the world should listen to his music. You know, he is just, he's so brilliant, you know? so so brilliant and i just like to say to my husband if you're watching this <laughs> when you ask me to marry you i need you to play one of your songs okay i need that to be in the background because wow what a voice so angelic i just feel like i want his music to be in the background of every important moment in my life you know like if it's a moment if it's important i want jacob banks to be the subliminal messaging behind he oh he's just so awesome <laughs> he's so awesome and that song 
found that song too much oh man i just can't believe that he exists and his voice exists no honestly it's just his voice i can't believe his voice is a thing that i get to experience in this plane it's wow he is so brilliant and he's apparently coming to well he is already in south africa and it's apparently for the first time so what a treat um also i initially wanted to do that cute finger wave hairstyle i really did and <laughs> Once I had already started, I, oh, I had that foam, and I'm sure you would have seen earlier clips, that foam, put it on my head, but I was worried that my hair has too much growth, and the thing is not going to stick, so I panicked, and I put gel, I just put gel, and I decided I'm going to make it a pony, did I know this thing would stick on that tiny hair? I didn't, I moved with faith. <laughs> And it is faith that shall carry me. Actually, I think my products are a little too light for, for my skin right now. Because my scalp is slightly darker. The change in weather <laughs> but I mean it's not that shocking to me when I looked at the weeks where the focused focused <laughs> focused when I look at when I looked at the focused it said that it would rain or it would be like cloudy and there'd be thunderstorms throughout today so I'm not that shocked I'm just convinced that it is a ploy against me because this whole week has been nice and sunny and then today it just decides you know what i'm gonna cut the cameras <sighs> okay i'm gonna go in with concealer from under my eyes and i use this one this quick face one also i'm just using one brush for everything Ignorance is bliss, beloved. I think I could have gone slightly darker and then only lighter on top. That's too slow. I don't because it tends to like crease it tends to crease under the eye so well how would I know Using my nails as tools, that's my spec. I'm just trying to refine. Oh, oh, this brush is just way too thick for what I'm trying to do. The best thing about, I think I also said this in like 
some old vlog about doing makeup when you're like not a pro or it's that I think you guys are still zoomed in hmm. the best thing about it is that you just get to like you get to try and air on the job and sometimes you win and sometimes you get to look like a clown <laughs> you never know it's a bet you're just constantly betting I think contouring is gonna make me feel slightly better. This is too sharp for me. I don't know, should it look like this? I'm gonna try and brush it out. Because I don't know if it should look like this. Okay, that brushing thing makes me look textured. Okay, let me contour and maybe it's gonna come together. Another thing with this contouring business is as a big forehead girly and I'm I'm a big forehead girly. I feel like when you try to make your forehead look smaller, it's in vain. You know, I just I don't I don't ever see it working. And Okay, obviously there's always the great possibility that it's because I don't know how to do it. But... Maybe it's also just that my forehead is meant to look big, you know? I can't ever make it look smaller. So I don't try. Oh, like, I don't try. If today is the day that you see me for the first time and you're shocked by the fact that... I'm just forehead. <laughs> Congratulations. You should just make a wish. It's the best thing about me. Make a wish. I think growing up, one thing I always wanted to do was like live in a fringe because I was low key insecure about my forehead. Not in a, not in a, you know, self conscious way. No, actually, high key in a self conscious way, but not in a, unhealthy self-esteem way you know everybody's like forehead forehead whatever on a lady right and i guess it's inevitable to feel like there's something that you can do to conceal it and i think there, were, there was like a point where all i wanted to do was entertain I think they're just gonna be too cute. Mm. Decided to do gold hoops. I am waiting for my ride. This app shows us guys driving in the opposite direction. That's fun. My ride is here.
Take me home.